Hello and welcome back guys, it's me again, and welcome back to Stairsbekistan! And I just broke something. Okay then. <laughs> At any rate, in the last episode, which as of this moment has yet to be uploaded, uh, we did it. We got the Never Portal opened, and uh, yeah, we can go to the Never at our leisure. This time, I'm not exactly sure as to what exactly we're going to be doing. Well, okay, that's a bit of a lie. Um, there's actually several things that I want to take care of at this point, now that we have access to uh, the Never. I'd prefer not to be using the Diamond Pickaxe if I absolutely don't have to. Alright, those stone pickaxes are about to go, so... Uh, well, I guess I know what our first order of business is. Our first order of business is chopping down some trees. Because, yeah, apparently we need more wood. Buddy, I wouldn't be in this area if I were you. Because, yeah, all three of the sheep that were once in this area are not exactly alive anymore, I'll say that much. But, uh, yeah, speaking of which, we do need to bring grass down there at some point. We also have a real Enderman problem in this area still, it seems. Alright, do I really care what kind of wood it is? Not really at the moment. Alright, we got a bit of spruce. Uh, we can craft that. Actually, okay, I need sticks, and I need a crafting table to actually do what I need to do. But, uh, yeah. So, let's grab a bit more wood here. As much wood as we can get, hopefully. Oh, okay, that's enough. Uh, hmm. Alright then, and now, uh, you guys are not going to like this next part. We're going to need to go cow tipping. Yes, cow tipping. Because the main goal of today is getting the enchantment room ready. I'm hammering on the right trigger like crazy. There's the other one. But yeah, we need more wood, but we also need more lever. Okay, don't want that gone. We actually really need that. Without it, mobs will spawn, and it will not be a good day in Stairsbekistan. Oh, come on. Or, okay, you can do that. All right, there we go. But, uh, yeah, we're getting hungry, it seems, so, uh, let us head back to base. And we should be able to get a couple more bookshelves in order for the enchanting room. I feel as though that pickaxe is going to run out the next time we go through that area, so I guess while we're here, um, I'm going to make me a couple more, uh, I'm going to make me at least one more pickaxe for the road. 
because I know that I'm going to need it. Alright. Spruce planks. And if we go over here, grab ourselves a couple bookshelves. And we got an achievement! Librarian. Um, okay then. I'm going to be honest. I'm quite surprised that I haven't gotten that achievement yet. Okay, so we have most of the books. I think we need the sugar cane now to grow in order to make more books. Um, all right then, some of the sugar cane has grown, but not all of it, it would seem. I'm also not taking good care of my farm. I'm gonna have to fix that. Um, okay, that's literally all the sugar cane we have. So, uh, let's turn that into three sheets of paper. We should be able to make one more book out of that. And we do not have enough for a bookshelf. We need three. All right, then. So I guess we're heading back outside. I think we have more than enough cows to the point where we won't have to worry about, you know, lever. But if it gets to be an issue, I'm probably going to have to, you know, get more. Actually, do I have food on me? I do have raw beef, but I really shouldn't be eating raw food. Okay. That should last us for a little bit. All right, then. Been a while since we've been this far out from base. Hopefully we'll be able to find something out here. Uh, hmm. Okay, yeah, I can just... You know, I can just get out of this pit using this area. I think the light level's starting to drop. I might need to go back to base soon. Because otherwise, uh, we might come uh, face to face with nighttime. Which would not be good for us. Ah, another cow. We're also on the lookout for sugarcane as well. Like, if we find it, we gotta take it. Okay, I found Cal Central Station over here. Oh, boy. This cow is having a really bad time. All right then, 19 lever. It is free per bookshelf, essentially, because it costs one lever to make a book. Okay then. But yeah, it costs free lever to make a book. And you need free books for a bookshelf. So it's free books per bookshelf. No, uh, no, it's free lever per bookshelf. That was what I was trying to say. So far, we seem to be looking pretty good in the lever department. There is lava down there. I don't want to set that off. Because that would not be good. Now, the good news is, uh, the world will spawn more cows in, so... go. All right then. There's a wolf out here. Yeah, wolves, wolves have a tendency to be a bit evil in Sirzbekistan. Just throwing that out there. Wolves have a tendency to be very not nice. And yeah, it's definitely getting dark out. 
If this cow cooperates, we might be able to get one more piece of lever. Also, I've been getting really lucky with the lever drops on these cows. In some of the other worlds I've played on, uh, we have not been anywhere near as lucky in regards to the lever drops. But yeah, we have to get back to base, because it is definitely getting dark, and I don't want to be out here when mobs start spawning. Uh, okay then, yeah, we're on the right track. We just have to head back over this way. We also need food. I guess I'm going to be cooking a lot of this tonight, provided I have the coal for it. Okay, yeah, there's a torch inside of that. Uh, that was where... I think that was where... No. Um, yellow one was over there, I think. So that would be where the red one was, I want to say. All right. We need to get into back. We need. Uh, we need to get back into the base now. We need to head downstairs. Have we got any coal lying around somewhere? Because I could really use this food being cooked. Yes, we definitely do. Okay then. Uh, let's unload one of these buckets into our inventory for the time being. Put the coal in here. And put the raw beef in. With any luck, we should wake up to some tasty, tasty cooked beef. All right, then. So, uh, new day. And steak. Wonderful. All right, then. We still really need... We still really need sugarcane. If I can get sugarcane from anywhere, that would be nice. Okay, there's a cow over there. I uh, may as well go cow tipping. And that is actually what they do for their death animation, so. Oh boy, Enderman. There is an Enderman wandering down there. That's not good. Because I believe there is sugarcane really close to that location. And we're not underground, so we don't have the tactical advantage of, you know, being in Sirsbakistan and knowing the land better than they do. All right, then. We should be around Van Enderman's territory at this point. But yeah, okay, there was no sugarcane back there, so there was no harm done in going around that area. There's got to be some sugarcane somewhere, though. Unless I've just gone and already mined up all the sugarcane I can get. Which would not be a good thing, I don't think. We're using the TH a lot in this episode, it seems. Like, the TH sound. I guess that leads me into a bit of a funny story. Uh, I actually can't pronounce the TH sound correctly. I, I don't actually use my tongue to pronounce it. Yeah, it's a bit of a weird thing that uh, has been with me for a long time now, I will say. Yeah, I've never been able to pronounce the TH sound correctly. So like in free and thing and I think we've reached the end of the world. Uh but yeah. So I think it's a pretty safe bet that there isn't going to be any you know, there isn't gonna be any sugarcane along there. 
Oh, dolphins! Okay. We don't have many new features, but I'm actually glad that we have dolphins. Love dolphins. Probably one of the cutest things. And we have fish, too. Not sure what that is. Okay, that is interesting, because we did not actually get guardians. Although, then again, we do actually have... We, actually, we don't actually have dolphins in our home waters. So that in and of itself is pretty interesting. So is that, although I do believe the moment we go down there we're going to disturb it, so probably best to leave it be. We've got acacia wood, and hey, it's been a while since we've been here. Oh, let's check in on the local populace. Why not? We're here. We may as well. Oh. Uh, oh, okay, we have one person. One, two... Okay, so we did get away from this village in time when we first visited it. Because there's at least four inhabitants left. That is good. That is really, really good. Because when we last left that village, I don't know if it was on camera or not, but when I last left that village, uh, yeah, zombies abound. That was, uh, needless to say, not good, and a moment I would rather not have to risk repeating. Got a little bit of the village over here, which is a bit strange. Also, I guess we are in, uh, uncharted territory in this, at this point. Hence, uh, the lag in the game. It's trying to generate new chunks. Oh, bunnies! Okay, we got bunnies. Sand bunnies, mostly, but there's still bunnies. Oh, we got a dead bush. Got a bit of an island thing going on here, which is kind of interesting. But seriously, oh, finally, finally, we had to journey this far. Sugar cane. Yes, I'm taking it. I'm taking all of it. I would replant it, but I've already got a sugar cane farm going in my uh, area. Although... I was contemplating making, like, a separate sugarcane farm, like a proper sugarcane farm. I'm not sure what I'd use the the space for in the uh, New Farmlandia area. But, uh, yeah. Uh, let's see if we can go cow tipping. Why not? We got the time for it, I think. Oh, boy. That is a new mob. That is the Drowned. A uh, new variation of the zombie, so obviously it is a hostile mob. Uh, they generally preside in the deep, but it seems, as we just saw, that if they come up on the surface, they do catch fire, like any other zombie normally would. So, uh, that is, that is interesting at the very least. Okay, that's another drown down there. Yeah, there's a, there's an awful lot of drowned over here. Aw, sea turtles! Aw, they're so cute. I'm sorry if I'm just gushing over stuff, but... Yeah, it looks like Update Aquatic really affected this portion of the world. I'm guessing it's because we're hardly over here at all, but... Yeah, that that is something. We actually have Update Aquatic content. Which is good. I mean, other than the water, like, changing color. Because that is something that was... Okay, yeah, that made my heart skip a beat there. I thought we were going to die via fall damage. That's not something I want. Oh, okay, then speaking of something I don't want, that is a ravine right there. If we go down there, we're going to... We're going to perish, needless to say. Uh, But yeah, that would not be good. Uh, but yeah. I guess now we're heading back into Stairsbekistan proper, because we're getting into the snowy area now. But yeah, we have update aquatic content other than, uh, the whole... Other than the whole, you know, water changing colors from the, uh, dark blue it was beforehand. Which is something. 
Okay. I will say this. Um, our trip in regards to trying to find sugarcane turned up mostly fruitless. So, if it's any consolation, the sugarcane at the home base will probably have already grown, which is good. Okay, sun is going down, so we are heading in the right direction. We actually need to eat more steak, but I don't have any more steak on me. Okay, we know where we are now, so we just gotta, gotta head to the left. Yeah, I will say this, foreign relations have have not been good so far, to say the least. Uh, yeah, sheep on a tree stand is one key example of this. Oh boy, wolves. Hey, we have a llama! Okay, that is not something you see every day. I'm not exactly sure what the benefits of having a llama are. I would... Now I really want a llama, but I don't know how to get it. Okay. Uh, but yeah, that's a lot of new content for one day, it seems. Alright. Let's head down here, because our sugar cane probably has grown by this point. I'm going to let this next audio clip speak for itself here. Disappointed! All right, then. So, uh, yeah. I guess we can make paper and make more bookshelves, but, uh, yeah, that is fairly underwhelming. I will say that much. Uh, so, more books, and we have enough to make one more bookshelf. Just, just one more bookshelf. I guess that's fine. We do complete the bottom row over here. Uh, but yeah. I guess the next thing I really want to do, then, is, uh is number one, grab the cooked beef, because, uh, yeah, we are starting to run a bit low in that regard. I'm gonna cook the rest of the raw beef over here. And yeah, that is very filling mistakes. I should go cow tipping more often, as horrible as that sounds. Um... I guess we could go mining. The thing is, I know what I want at this point. I do want lapis, because that's the only ore we haven't dug up yet. But, uh, yeah. I really don't know where it would be. I guess what I'll do is go mining for lapis off-camera. And if I find it, I'll go back on camera to say, hey, I found it. But, uh, yeah. I'm genuinely at a loss as to what to do next. We could go back to the Never, but I feel as though that deserves its own episode. But, uh, I guess we're gonna cut it here. So, uh, thank you very much for watching. I know... Not much happened in this episode, but, uh, I guess we'll see you in the next episode. Bye! <laughs> oh, I broke it again.